Okay. Well, welcome to our channel. If you are new, please subscribe. We need it. Uh, this is a new segment called Saturday Situation. This is where we talk sports. On the first episode, we will talk about the NBA playoffs so far. I'll be talking about the Western Conference. He'll talk about the East. Let's talk about the Cleveland-Boston series. Cleveland's up 3 to nothing. Of course, LeBron is balling like he always is. In Game 2, we saw alley-oops from midcourt and everything. Then, we saw Kyrie and LeBron get the last 28 points of the game. But, they're not just blowing Boston out. They're shocking everyone. And keeping it close. Here is the San Antonio against the Clippers game. This is a heated rivalry already, and just to make it a first round playoffs game makes it even more. So the series is two to one in the Spurs' favor. Uh, each game has one player who's been balling. You know, in one for the Clippers one by fifteen, it was Chris Paul. In game two, it was Tim Duncan. In three, it was my boy, um, Kawhi Leonard. But we're excited to see how this series is going to end. Let's talk about the Bucks and the Bulls. The Bulls have been dominating, stopping the human freak. They have been scoring through Derrick Rose and Jimmy Butler. 3-0 series again in Bulls' favor. The Mavs and the Rockets, a Texas showdown, if you will. This has been a boring series, in my opinion. And... James Harden has just been himself, you know, popping threes, making defenses look ser silly. Uh, the Mavs just cannot stop any on another team. A little hard. And Sorry. Houston is up three to nothing. Um, the Wizards and Raptors. Um, two words for the series: Paul Pierce. He is been the star for this series. DeRozan and the Raptors need a historic stop to win. Yep. Uh, Memphis and the Trailblazers. Not much to say here again. 3-0 series lead for the Memphis Grizzlies. I do know that there has been tension against these teams, specifically with the player uh, Mark Gasol. Uh, we hopefully will not see anyone get hurt and no more technicals being thrown. Final game is the Hawks and the Nets. The 3 0 Hawks lead is no surprise to anyone since they did so good in the regular season. Um, the Nets, though, could have won game three but fell behind in final minutes. We, we hope to see these two teams continue to be successful. Final game for me, too. The Warriors and the Pelicans. Magic. That's how I explain Golden State. Curry is making magic in game three. I mean, he went into fourth quarter, leading his team down by 20 in New Orleans, in New Orleans, and they still won the game. Magical. Okay, I'm going to say my prediction for the finals. Do that one. For the Eastern Conference... Um, I don't even know. Start with the Western Conference. Okay, Western Conference. Um, San Antonio is going to beat the Clippers. Okay. Golden State is going to beat the Pelicans. Tell me, tell me, actually tell me who you think the two finalists are going to be. For the finals? For the Western Conference. Um, Two final teams. The Spurs. Warriors. Okay, Spurs and Warriors. What about the Eastern Conference? I'm going to have to go with Cleveland and the Wizards. Alright, who do you think is going to win against the Wizards in the C Cleveland? I'm going to go with the Wizards. All right, he's going to go with the Wizards. What about the Golden State and San Antonio? 
<laughs> his favorite team is San Antonio. My favorite team is the Warriors. So I'm going to go with the Warriors. All right. So and who do you Warriors think's gonna, and Wizards. So who do you think is going to win in how many games? Even though my favorite team is the Warriors, I don't think they're going to win the finals. I think the Wizards are going to win the finals. In how many games? Six games. Six games. They're MVP. with the new Paul Pierce. Paul Pierce, MVP. All right, so my Western Conference Finals, same as his. The Golden State and San Antonio. My Eastern, same as his. Cleveland and the Wizards. And I do think the Wizards are going to win, but I think San Antonio is going to win. And I think, I'm confident with my team, that the Spurs are going to win in five games. We'll, we'll let the Wizards try to shake us up in the first game, and then we'll win four straight. MVP, Tim Duncan, last year, you know it. And then goodbye, people. That is our Saturday situation. Come back for more. We will probably be talking about the MLB next week. Come episode back, two. subscribe, episode two. We can talk about the beginning of the season. See you later. See ya.